beautiful people of YouTube and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Noye and I'm a Nigerian teacher. I live and work in Lagos, Nigeria. In today's video, I'm going to share five of my fantastic favorite resources that have been helping me in this situation that we're all in together okay if you're interested in this video i'd like you to keep watching but wait number four and number five are my favorites and you do not want to miss number four and number five but And my first favorite app that I have been using already is the Google Classroom. Everybody knows that the Google Classroom is a virtual classroom where you can have meet your children, meet your students. I like the fact that I can create my assignment from the scratch. I can use the assignment options. I can use the quiz options. I can use the form options. I can use different uh, options on the Google Classroom. And I like the fact that I can add my own resources. I can add them from my drive. I can share a link. I can add them from files. And I can also share a YouTube video or with you or with my students. I like that option a whole lot. And I can create my topics and content from the very scratch. So everything that I need in the classroom is available virtually in the Google Classroom Connect. So that's my number one. The second one that I have been using has been the Zoom. I did a video recently on my Zoom on how I use Zoom on my phone. If you're interested in that video, I'm going to put the link somewhere on the screen right here so that you can click on it and then watch it or you can find it in the description box and then you can watch it so zoom helps you with video conferencing and having a real life a real time talk with your pupils or with your students so if you do not have that app already on your phone i think you should download it, download it. some people use the meet option right and that's the hangout or the meet in the google classroom but if your school is not built into a console like the g suite where you can all come in as a community now you may have challenges meeting people outside of your G Suite community. That's why I suggest Zoom. Or that's why I use Zoom for people that are not within my school community. So that's number two. My third option will be to use WhatsApp. WhatsApp basically for me is for children or students or teachers who do not have access to devices or to data or power. That's why you're not leaving everybody out. You because an average person has a smartphone so you can use your smartphone and then take a picture of what you have to send to these children I've done a video on how to use whatsapp to teach so you can find that I'm going to attach that in the link or you can find it in the description but that way you can go and watch it and see how you can also help children who do not have access to devices or who do, may not be able to afford data in this time remember an average person right now is thinking of how to at least feed and you know some parents may not have that all that time to start to gain access to google classroom or other resources that may be available so whatsapp may be the only option so please be kind to those people also by making their assignment or instruction or what they have to send to them accessible via whatsapp so my first option that i ask you to wait for i'm glad you waited for it is the twinkle resource twinkle has a, is a website right and it has these amazing resources for children from preschool to post-secondary school it's an amazing resource bank believe me it has a free version and a paid version my school is on the paid version so we get access to more resources but if it's on uh if you are on a budget so you can go for their free options right the free resources so it has all the curriculum i like the fact that it is well planned based on curriculum and scheme of work for each school and the way school systems grow so they help you plan already so all you need to do is get the get your resources and it's really amazing i like the fact that they also have planners for different categories of people they have planner for teachers their planning system is amazing i used one of their planners for my 2020 teacher planner and it's really amazing you may want to try that app, Twinkle. And the fifth and which is the final one is Top Mark resources. Top Mark basically have resources that you can use to teach and you can use to learn. They have basically games also that you can use. They're more like apps that can be downloaded, but then they have different resources on their website that you can play in real time. So you want to check that out from numeracy resources to literacy resources. I use more of their numeracy resources because it has everything in the app in the scheme and curriculum for numeracy so you may want to try top marks I've, I've done a video on math app that you can use i found a lot from top marks i've done another one on the ones that you can use for preschoolers and top marks believe me is fantastic you may want to try them out i'm going to put the link 
in the description box should you get interested or if you are interested then you may want to check them out if you like this video give it a thumb up come on that way more people can get to watch it you can share this video comment on it let me know what you think you can also share your resources with me come on i'd like to know what you're doing let's share together let's find out what's happening and how you're taking care as a teacher how you're taking care as a parent remember that you have to relax take it cool take it nice and slow let me know what you think in the comment section if you're not subscribed to this channel already i think you should do that now yeah take a few seconds and then click on the subscribe button that way you're helping this channel grow but then if you need more people to watch this content please click on the like button and you're free to share it okay until i come your way in another video it's me signing out now and saying take care bye and be blessed if you are new to my channel click on the subscribe button tap on the notification bell like it comment and share thank you